Hello everyone, thank you for coming back to my second video. This is going to be the very first, quote unquote, um, not really the first video, but it is the first day, the welcome home day to the Bachelor Challenge. My name is Tabitha, this is Simply Sims with Tabitha, and I hope you all enjoy. I picked the Willow Creek area just because I find it beautiful. It's very homey. Everything we need is basically here um, when we want to go travel, so that is why I picked this. This is actually their home, too. Um, I found this home on the gallery. It is someone's amazing, amazing house that they built. I'm not even for sure who did it um, to credit them, but I will go back and look and see. This is called the Kardashian home. Uh... <laughs> I know how a lot of people feel about the Kardashians, but I figured since it was called, called the Kardashian home that it would be pretty epic, and I was kind of really right. Um, it's absolutely beautiful. It is so beautiful here. So I am a total idiot, I guess, and forgot to save my household when I made it in the other video. Yes, yes I did. But I do remember um, what we had Brody looking like. So this is him. I added some CC to him, um, his eyes, and I gave him a better skin tone. So I really am digging the way that he looks now. Look how handsome. And I ended up giving him earrings, even though I said I wasn't. So needless to say, all the girls that I had picked originally do not exist anymore and these are all different females that you are seeing oh I was supposed to keep this a secret too from you all the traits and stuff that he has so I guess that worked out pretty great considering the fact that I had to restart everything over so Brody James is a is he a young adult I hope yes he is a young adult I hope these are all young adults Okay, anyway, Bertie James is a perfectionist, he's a romantic, he's a goofball, and he has the domestic trait, which means he wants a family. The next person we have is the lovely Miss Kelly Paul. And Kelly Paul, if we can get to her, there she is, very cute redhead. Kelly Paul is insane. <laughs> She is also active. She has the bro trait and the essence of flavor. So she has the food aspiration. She's going to be our cooker, I'm assuming. Our little chef. Isabella Adams. Isabella. Isabella. Let's get to Isabella. She looks so young and little to me. Isabella loves the outdoors. She is a music lover. She is business savvy. She's also evil and thrifty. So she wanted a mansion. She got it when she landed here. It popped up in the corner saying that she had, oh, she had her mansion. So she is living the life right now, which makes me wonder, is she here for love or fame? I don't know. I guess we will have to see. Next one is Kiki Starlight. Kiki is right beside Isabella. Um, which is such a funny name for, she just looks so very poised and her name's Kiki Starlight. <laughs> anyway, Kiki is neat. She's a music lover also. She has the jealous trait, which could make for some good TV. Katie Shin. Katie, 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 where's Katie? I think Katie is so cute. I don't know why. I just think she's totes adorbs. Katie is also business savvy. So is she here for love or money? Who knows? Who knows? She is also good, though. A goofball, which they have in common. Her and Brody will both be goofballs. And she's a foodie. So for someone who stays in such great shape, she loves her some food. Our next contestant on the show is Casey Mills. Casey Mills. Casey Mills. She is cheerful. She is family oriented. So she wants a family. She's also clumsy. And she can cook. So, I don't know. She's funny. Or wait, no. She's happy. Wants a family. 
can cook. Could be wifey material. Just saying. Next we have Carly Lima. Carly Lima is very businessy, I think. She looks very, very put together. She is an art lover who is outgoing. She's also business savvy. She is self-assured and thrifty. So she knows she's hot stuff. And last but not least, we have Faith Wilson. Faith Wilson <laughs> is a snob who is jealous, materialistic, and business savvy. So he has a lot of business savvy females here. I didn't change any of their traits when I picked them off the gallery. So what they are is what the person who made them is. So I never realized that I picked so many business savvy women. So this could be this could be very interesting to see who is going to be here for love with Brody and who is going to be here just to be on TV and gain some popularity and some social media lovers so we shall see but the first day is welcome home I also decided that I'm not going to go by the actual day on the sims um, because we know those pass by so fast um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take it episode by episode. So day one will be episode one, day two, so on and so forth. Um, that way we can actually get them in, have them interact with people, and uh, see where this takes us. I'm really, really, really excited about this. I'm not even going to lie. But eliminations are every third day or third episode at 3 p.m. sharp so we will not have to eliminate anyone until our third episode also money is not an issue this house cost me over a million sim money <laughs> it's so crazy I had to mother load like crazy to get this house um, also no one can woohoo no one can woohoo until you're down to two sims contestants and then that can create some jealousy issues, which I think is also going to be pretty fun. Um, but for the first day, everything is fun and relaxed. Everyone's just getting to know everybody. And we will start that now. Okay. Hopefully that water is not too loud. Everybody's just kind of chilling right now. They're like, mm, what do we do? Where, where are we going? Uh, I think... Who is that that just ran off? They're just running off. Where are they going? Carly's like, I'm going to go grab me a bed. I am not waiting on these heifers. I'm going to go find me. Oh, no. That wasn't even a Carly that ran off. Okay. They are getting along pretty well. Katie and Carly... Oh, that's a really cute name, too. Katie and Carly, besties. That's cute. We have wild onions. Nope. Is that a wild onion? Nope. Just a random flower. Nope. Wild lily. Okay, where did Brody go? Where is Brody going? Brody is checking out the pad. He is... As you can see, we have so much to do here. So I don't even know why they would want to leave the house to go on a date, to be completely honest. This place is freaking fantastic. Um, really, Brody, you have seven females here waiting for dates and you grab the iPad. Welcome to 2016, people. <laughs> if that isn't any more accurate, I don't know what is. Um, all the girls so far are getting along. Oh, wait. They're watching TV and playing a game. If that's not multitasking, I don't know what is. Um, but yeah, while they're doing this, I guess we can go through everything. I can show you the house, kind of. Um, this is, I guess, a bar slash let's party room. Um, are we in the basement? We are in the basement. <laughs> I didn't even know the house had a basement. Wow. There's another bedroom. Because I was really scared that we wouldn't have enough beds. But we did. And now here's an extra one. So, question. Why would you have teddy bears in this bedroom? <sighs> I don't know. But, whatever. Another bathroom. Um, let's do this. There's a bathroom. 
very cute. I love the layout of this house. There's another little seating area, another bedroom, another, ooh, I love this bathroom. Look how freaking cute that is. Wow, I love this house. Love it. Um, the welcome wagon is here though. There's more bedrooms down here. There's another bathroom. Another bed. Another bedroom with teddy bears. Um, more TVs. Why are these girls even going to want to get to know him? <laughs> when they have all of this going on. I'd be like, who are you, dude? Oh, there's a cute little seating area. Um... Okay, let's go welcome in the welcome wagon. Where is the welcome wagon? They are out here. Well, did we move into... What did we move into? The elderly place? Where's our front door? <laughs> I'm so confused. Okay, um, Brody, come welcome these people. Welcome your neighbors. Be nice. Well, she is not happy. She, well, well, just, just come on in. Just come, wow, just hello. Welcome yourself right on in. I don't even have to invite you in. You just come on in. There's the fruit cake. I always heard that eating the fruit cake made you sick. Um, made the Sims sick. I'm not for sure. Because, um, I've never ate it, because I was scared. So, maybe we might eat it here, though. <laughs> Just to see if the girls get sick. That could be funny. So, this is Alice Spencer Kim. There's Dennis Kim. I'm assuming they are married. Apparently, he is loving our house, though, with all those little... Things flying off. Faith is feeling very confident, though. Faith, Faith, why are you feeling confident? You're not doing anything but watching TV. Look at all these people just hanging out at our house. Like, hey. You can sit here and dance a little. We gonna dance. Um, while people are still doing this, I can still take you through the house, I guess. So, the rest of the house is, you come upstairs from the basement. Ooh, I see a flaw. I see a flaw here. Oh, I guess we're not wanted here. Dude! I went and welcomed you all in. Whatever. Why are all these TVs on? <laughs> okay. So... I guess this is another little living area. This is actually could be where we hold the... I don't know. Could we hold the eliminations there? I don't know. Maybe in here? Very pretty. Very pretty. Um, yeah, this looks very nice. Okay, so then you have this living room area. And then you have another bathroom. Another bedroom. More bedrooms. The entrance way to the house. Another bathroom another bedroom. This looks like it's supposed to be a kid's bedroom, maybe. Whoever made this house really loved the stuffed animals. Um, another bathroom. And here I was scared that we wouldn't have enough bathrooms and bedrooms. <laughs> what was I done? Outside sitting area, a bar, um, the Here's another, I don't, is that a patio? Yeah, I guess this is a patio setting. Um, on upstairs, you have all these little doors that in, like lead out to chess and painting and just sitting. There's a, um, what is this called? Oh my goodness, I'm having a moment. There's another easel. Um, what is this called? 
what is this called? I'm having a moment. Wow, I can't even, a grill, a grill. <laughs> I'm sure you all were yelling, grill, Tabitha. Yeah, a grill. <laughs> There's more seating out here. Um, more bedrooms, more bathrooms, workout area. Um, there's where he's going to serenade them with some music. Um, I do love, 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 love the waterfall in the house. I think the waterfall down here is my favorite. How beautiful is that? How gorgeous. Okay, no one better not be, why is, why is he feeling flirty? What is he doing? Why is he chatting online? When he has females in the house. What are you doing, Brody? Are you not digging these women? Probably because you haven't even got to know them. Stop chatting with females, weirdo. Stop it. You are not allowed to get on the internet on your dating site. We know you're single. We know you're looking for love. We know you're desperate. But you have seven amazing females here so get off the damn computer man <laughs> okay so that is the rest of the house just bathrooms and stuff um and then that's it on the back side we have another fountain place for them to sit another grill more places for them to sit it's just oh, i just love this place i love it Look how pretty. I'm so in awe with how gorgeous this house is. I have to link whoever made this house because they did a freaking fantastic job. Even with the pool out here and the little places to sit. So beautiful. So beautiful. Brody is going to go talk to Kelly. Wow. He... Kiki has, oh wow, she's mastered some mischief skills. That's great. Okay, I think I'm going to do is just go down the line here with each girl. Since he started with Kelly, it's a great start. And we will get to know these people. We will get to know these girls. Oh, who is she? Who is she talking to? Oh, she is watching TV. Really? You're watching TV right now? Okay, let's... Oh, she's the crazy one. She's the crazy one, and he's flirty. <laughs> let's get to know her. Let's ask her about her day. Let's, um... Let's see. Watch Sims of the Dead with Kelly. Okay, she likes scary movies too, apparently. Oh, he's done with that. He is going back to the computer. Are you serious right now, Brody? No! You need to find Isabella, who is down here watching TV, and you need to come talk to her. Hey, get back here. It's sad when I have to pause stuff just to get their attention. Okay, so... <laughs> He wants to ask about love life, really. What are his... Okay, he needs to take a cold shower because he's feeling flirty for some reason talking to some hoe on the internet. Make something of excellent quality. We can keep that. And he wants to be mischievous. Okay. Whatever floats his boat. Let's, um... Let's get to know... Who is this? <laughs> Isabella. It's going to be hard to try and remember their names at first. Let's get to know Isabella. Um, come on, Brody. Come on. Let's speed this up. Let's get you to where you need to go. Come on. There we go. Okay. Let's... Aww. Did he really... Did you hear that? Oh, no, he did the same thing with her, too. So he's just hes just feeling too kinds of, too many kinds of lovey right now. Um, Katie is cooking. She learned some eggs and toast, BLT, chips and salsa, fish tacos. 
She ain't even worried about a man right now. She's like, I am hungry. I'm hungry. Okay, so let's ask about day, and then we will ask her about day. And then we are going to kill two birds, one stone. We are going to, let's see, discuss interest. Why is he so flirty right now? We need to, we'll goof around with her. Okay, she's done talking. <laughs> Alright. See you later, Casey. Um, let's ask her about day. What are these things flying around? Okay, let's do an impression. <laughs> Sometimes I get too into watching them interact. Okay, he, where's he going? Oh, he's going to go take a piece of this fruitcake and probably get sick and die. Why is the, why is the fruitcake in the bathroom? Okay, here we go. We're going to sit down and have a conversation with these girls. They're all eating fruitcake, so if they all get sick, we know why. Why is he very... Oh, yep. See? The fruitcake makes you... What did I just eat? Yuck. Does anyone eat that fruitcake stuff? So it does make everybody sick. That's great. Welcome home, every girl, everyone. Let's all hang out in the bathroom all day puking. Lovely. She looks so sad. Oh, oh, everybody is sick. That's awesome. Including Brody. Everybody's gonna puke. Why is she eating more when it made her sick? Really? Well, I guess this is a good time to get to know her. Who have we not got to know yet? We haven't talked to Kiki, I don't think. Where's relationships? Okay. Oh, we have. We have talked to him or her. So, have we talked? Okay, basically it's just an acquaintance. So, it's not a lot of talking going on there. Um... Yeah, they all... Why are they getting more food? Why are they getting more cake when they hate it? Why? I don't understand. I don't get it. Why are you continuing to eat that nasty stuff? Her little lip is quivering. It's so bad. It's maybe they're like, oh well, she's just. Oh my goodness, she looks so sad. Oh. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Katie's like, I'm just trying to make a bunny, bitch. Just trying to make a bunny. Crazy. Okay. He's watching all of this go down. He's like, what have I got myself into? These people are nuts. Okay, call over... Katie. Kiki is going to clean up the house, apparently. Does she have the cleaning, the neat? Yep, she's neat. So, he was supposed to call her over. She did not listen. What is she going to do? She's going to clean up, too. So, I'm going to bring Brody down here to her. Whoa. Girl. How big does your glass need to be? Really? Y'all seeing this thing? One glass a day, huh? 
she gets the biggest glass there possibly is. Okay, stay right here. We are going to ask about Day, and we are going to keep her right here, because this will give them some, well, never mind. She doesn't want privacy with them. Nobody wants privacy. Everybody just wants to run around. Lord, this is difficult. These people. She's cute, though. She is so cute. Okay, where is he at? Okay, he's with her now. Here we go. I'm already starting... Really? Show off your muscles, Brody. Jeez. Oh, no. They're still talking. She just doesn't want to stand by him. There's another big glass. What is up with those girls drinking out of freaking gallon jugs? Oh, Casey is sick, and so is Isabella. Isabella is also really mad. Good Sims and evil Sims will never agree. The battle rages on. Ooh, Isabella can make for some good episodes. But I think you eliminate the person with the least... Um, interaction with Brody. So, I mean, it could either go any way, really. Especially when these females... Where is... Carly, get down here. Carly, I'm, tr I'm trying to get to know everybody, Carly. And you are in this box. Along with Faith. So you need to go down here. Let's speed this up. Let's get him down there with those two girls. Okay. Now let's kind of just chill right here. Until they... Okay, girls. No. Get out of that. <laughs> I need to talk to one of you. So, there we go. There we go. Get to know. No! Brody, it is not sleep time. I know it's 10.30, but come on. Get to know the, all of these girls at least a little first. Okay, we will gossip. We will get some dirt on some of the girls around here. Um, let's see, goof around. He will ask her about her day. He will... Um, uh, show off his muscles. <laughs> there we go. And then after that, we will get Faith. Uh-oh. Oh, wait, well, I guess that was good. I don't know. Oh, she's done with him. She's done. She's done. Okay. Come here, little Miss Faith. Let me brighten your day. Oh, she, she's so cute. She's like, hey. Tell a joke about some ducks. Let's tell a funny story. Let's get to know her. Yeah, step over here. Let me, let me buy you a drink. Let me get you a drink, girl. Oh, she's digging him. He's feeling very confident about this right now. Let's do a deep conversation. I hope the sound is not too low, because now I'm feeling like it might be a little too low. Guess we will see. But he's feeling very confident. She is happy. She's having a pleasant conversation with him. Um, and they are all going to bed. So I think... This might be a good place to end the very first episode. He did get to know everyone. He did talk to every girl at least once. Um, who he is having the most fun with, though, at this point is... Well, they're all about the same. They're 
all about the same. The next episode will be a date, though. They will go on a group date, I think. Pretty sure it's a group date. So, I'm going to end that here. Yes, especially since Kiki just woke up. So, I will end that here with him sleeping, everyone sleeping, except for Kiki, because apparently she went to sleep really early to be up at 2.50. <laughs> so, <clears throat> yes, that is the end of the very first episode. One, day one, welcome home, meeting all the girls, getting to know them, getting a feel of the house, getting a feel of the environment that they are in. I... I hope you all are having a fantastic day, and as always, until next time, mwah, bye everyone. Probably work with this. <laughs> okay. Maybe. Hopefully. <laughs> okay. So, um, oh goodness. Okay, let's take off the beard, let's take off the hair. He's gonna be a little bald man for right now. Just, <gasps> just a little bald man. Let's.